going, YouTube gang? It's Mel DFS coming to you live and direct. Here to get my favorite play sports today. We got a five game main slate. Hope everybody's having a great day. Feel free to like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Press that bell icon. Always stay notified for new videos. Let's get into these plays. Going to the first pick at point guard. Looking at Cole Anthony at 7,300 on DraftKings, 75 on FanDuel. Going against Portland. He's averaging 37.6 fans points in the past five games. Portland averaging 37 fans points to start in point guards. Definitely in play with Carter Jr. out. Does get a bump in usage. So, like this play for Cole Anthony for today. So, next play going to our shooting guards. Pay up. You got Anthony Simmons at 8,000 on DraftKings. Still like the price tag on FanDuel at 7,600. Even though Caesar McCollum is going to be on restricted minutes with the collapsed lung, I'm just glad he's back in the game. So, like Simmons, as he's in a good spot. Lando allowing 38.2 fans points to start point guard. And he's shooting guard eligible. So, I like this play for. Anthony Simmons, you want to pay up. Savings looking to get in Suggs at 4,800 on DraftKings, 54 on Vandal. Gets a usage bump and positive differential. Averaging 25.4 fantasy points and putting his bottom tier versus shooting guard reserves. I like just play for Jalen Suggs for value for today. Going to our small forwards. Jimmy Butler at 8,900. 91 on Fandle going against Toronto. At a 62 fantasy point game against them. And we have Lowry that is out for today. And Bam is game time decision. Uh, more likely will play today. He's averaging 43.4 fantasy points in the past five home games. And Toronto allows average 30.8 fantasy points to the starting small forwards. I just play for Jimmy Butler for today. Let's go to our next play, going to our power forwards. Get some savings. I want to look at Quiz Chris. He's 3,100 on DraftKings, 36 on FanDuel. He did get a two year extension with Dallas. And check him out against OKC. He had 25 last time this season. He had 14 minutes that game. 11.5 favor in this play for today. So I like the spot as he could be a great value spot on both platforms for today. Let's go to our last play. Going to our centers. LeBron James at the center position. 10,900 on DraftKings. He is priced up 11,200 on FanDuel. He had a post on Twitter apologizing to his fans about how horrible they've been playing. He's going to have a statement game going against Utah. 33.5 fans points to the starting centers. He could easily give you a 60 plus. Of course, we want to go for some savings. We do have JaVale McGee, 3,700 on DraftKings, like the price tag here, going against the Spurs with eight and out. He's averaging 22.5 fans points in the past two games versus the Spurs. Only averaged 14 minutes in both of those games. So as you can see, great savings point on DraftKings at his price point. These are my favorite plays, y'all. Like the plays, give a thumbs up. Use the Draft Dashboard tools in the link in my description. You want to sign up? It is a dollar up to 30 days. When you sign up, you get access to the NBA cheat sheet, your sleepers, and your studs. Click on the watch players. You get access to my plays up top. Watch Melo DFS picks, be the DraftKings or FanDuel. So I love y'all. Y'all collect that bag. It's Melo DFS, and y'all stay blessed. And I'll see y'all in the next video.